lose, there is no fail. Let's go. Seem like life go light to speed. Slow it on down, baby, just to breathe. It's cold outside, I just sleep. Got here late, like just to leave. Wings on my shirt, and I cannot fly. Asked to one lover, but I cannot lie. Open up the door, like can I ride? Heart made of stone, I cannot cry. Hand on the glass, I can feel the rain. You don't wanna fight, not feel your pain. But I gotta go hard, gotta go far. That don't mean that we gotta fall apart. I'ma stand to all of us. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to welcome you to another edition of SmackDown. We are two weeks away from the Backlash pay-per-view. We are coming to you from Daytona Beach, Florida for this edition of SmackDown here tonight. And folks, we're going to kick the night off with the former Intercontinental Champion, the Scottish Warrior, Drew McIntyre. At WrestleMania, Drew McIntyre lost the Intercontinental Championship in a triple threat match to Randy Orton. Now McIntyre is back here tonight. McIntyre is set to address the WWE Universe tonight. McIntyre was one heck of an Intercontinental Champion though. During McIntyre's reign, he successfully defended that title against Edge, Dolph Ziggler, The Miz, Jenna Mahal, Seth Rollins, and Keith Lee. I've been doing Universe Mode since 2K17, and I say McIntyre was probably the best Intercontinental Champion we've ever seen. McIntyre has a mic. I'm back where I belong, and that is here on SmackDown. At WrestleMania, I lost my Intercontinental Championship to Randy Orton. But here's the thing about it. I wasn't pinned in that match, but I'm not complaining. Because at the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks, I challenged Randy Orton to a rematch. Randy Orton pinned Keith Lee in that match. Now, I'm going to be honest. The same way I won in the Continental title was the same way I lost it. Because at SummerSlam, I pinned AJ Styles and not the champion Edge. And at WrestleMania, Randy Orton pinned Keith Lee and not me. So at this time, I would like for the Intercontinental Champion, Randy Orton, to come down to this ring. I have lots of respect for Randy Orton. But do I like him? No, I don't. But I do respect Randy. So Randy, this time, I am calling you down to this ring right now. And it looks like the Intercontinental Champion is going to oblige. Last week on SmackDown, we saw Randy Orton defeat Finn Balor in an incredible match. And there's the Intercontinental Champion, Randy Orton. Randy Orton won the Intercontinental Championship back at WrestleMania 10 nights ago. He will pin Keith Lee in a triple threat match. McIntyre was never pinned. But that doesn't matter. The rules of the triple threat. Whoever gains pinfall or submission wins the match and walks out as champion. Randy Orton has a mic. Let's see what the Apex Predator has to say. Haven't I already been you enough times? But Drew, the thing about it is, you'll never be better than me. You'll never be a better Intercontinental Champion than me. I've only been champion 10 days. And I've already been a better champion than you. You're lying to yourself. But Randy, it's okay. Because I called you down to this ring. So you can accept my challenge. For the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks. At Backlash, I challenge you to a match. For the Intercontinental Championship. One-on-one. -on -one, me and you.
Drew, I accept your challenge for Backlash. But here's the thing. We were supposed to fight at WrestleMania one-on-one, -on -one, but we didn't. So let's turn the heat up at the Backlash review. At Backlash, what do you say to a no disqualification match for the Intercontinental Championship? Sounds good to me. Now I can beat you with all type of weapons. The match has no rules. But here's the thing. You and I have never fought one on one for the Intercontinental title. So we need to make this match feel special. What do you say to a 2 out of 3 falls no disqualification match at the Backlash pay-per-view? So now I get to pin you not once but twice. You're making yourself look bad in this situation, Drew. But I accept your challenge. At Backlash, I will retain my Intercontinental Championship against you in a 2 out of 3 falls no disqualification match. That's what you think. Keep dreaming, Randy. Oh, uh, now McIntyre taking it to Randy Orton. So, folks, at Backlash, it looks like we have a two out of three falls no disqualification match for the Intercontinental title. And now look at Randy Orton with a float over neck break of the McIntyre. And now Randy Orton catches Drew McIntyre here. Follow a slam. McIntyre rolls out. McIntyre gets back in. Now McIntyre going to work on Randy Orton here. Iris whip over the top rope. Orton hangs on. And now McIntyre. Both look at the strength of McIntyre. Suplex back into the ring. There's an arm drag by McIntyre. Oh, what an error of McIntyre. And McIntyre with a power slam to Orton. And McIntyre with a close on to Orton. Folks, what's going to happen when these two face one another at Backlash in two weeks? We are back live here tonight on SmackDown. And folks, the match is now official at the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks. Randy Orton would defend the Intercontinental Championship in a two out of three falls no disqualification match against Drew McIntyre. Folks, what a battle that is going to be at Backlash. But folks, our first match of the night will be a tag team match. As the winner of this match will face the Hardy Boys next week. And the winner of the match next week We'll face the Usos at the Backlash pay-per-view. Out first, it's Sheamus and Cesaro. The bar have arrived here on SmackDown. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 499 pounds. The Celtic warrior Sheamus and Cesaro the Sheamus and Cesaro are now on SmackDown. This is the first time ever where the bar have been on SmackDown since I've been doing Universe Mode. Sheamus and Cesaro, former Raw Tag Team Champions in Seasons 2 and 3. And they're looking to capture some Tag Team titles here in Season 4. They have never held or challenged for the SmackDown Tag Team titles here in Universe Mode. Their opponents tonight, Chad Gable and Jason Jordan, American Alpha. And their opponents at a combined weight of 447 pounds, American Alpha. 
This is a big opportunity for American Alpha here tonight to take on the bar. It's been a minute since we've seen Chad Gable and Jason Jordan here on the Blue Brand. But they're back tonight. So folks, next week, we're either going to get the Bar versus the Hardy Boys. Or the Hardy Boys versus American Alpha. One or the other. Fans here tonight, Shannon, you look stupid to Sheamus. So Sheamus is going to start this match against Chad Gable. Sheamus just pushing away Chad Gable. Now Sheamus perhaps going for a power slam, but Chad Gable with a counter. There's a stunt right to the arm. Now Chad Gable, butterfly suplex. Shoulders down on Sheamus here. That's two. Oh, a near fall for Chad Gable. Oh, what a punch by Sheamus. And Sheamus with a huge knee. That knee just could have knocked Chad Gable out cold. Oh, but Chad Gable gets a shoulder up at two. That's a strike by Chad Gable. As a counter by Sheamus. And Sheamus with a shoulder tackle. Now Sheamus has a hold of Gable. Puts Gable in the corner. There's a tag to Cesaro. Now Cesaro. Oh man! With a springboard knee while Sheamus connected white noise. And there's a knee right to the side of the head by Cesaro. There's a kick to the back of the knee. And Gable, German suplex. Shoulders down to Cesaro here. That's two. Oh, but Cesaro gets a shoulder up at two. There's a leg drop by Chad Gable. Oh, what a kick by Cesaro. Another kick. Now Cesaro. Springboard uppercut. Cesaro is the king of uppercuts. Oh, what a forearm by Gable. Irish whip. He still ran into one another. That's a strike by Gable. Andre by Cesaro. He's still locking up here. Gable pushes away Cesaro. Irish whip. Sheamus tags himself in. Gable missed that strike, but he gets that one. That's a strike by Sheamus. That's a jawbreaker. Push Sheamus in that corner. There's a tag to Jason Jordan. Now, folks, Jason Jordan's been itching to get into this match. There's a bell of the bell of the Sheamus. There's an elbow right to the chest by Jason Jordan. Now, Jason Jordan slamming Sheamus down to the mat. Now, Jason Jordan picks up Sheamus, but Sheamus with a counter. Now, Jason Jordan countering Sheamus. And now he just takes down Sheamus. There's a strike by Sheamus. There's a kick by Jason Jordan. Now, Jason Jordan. I mean, he's not done. Another Northern Life suplex. That's two. Oh, Sheamus. This is showed up at two. Oh, man. A counter by Sheamus. Now, Sheamus puts Jordan in the corner. There's a tag to Cesaro. Now, this time they're going to do it to Jason Jordan. Oh, what a knee by Cesaro. Now Cesaro going to the middle rope. Oh man, nobody home for Cesaro. Bella the Bella to Cesaro. Now 
Now Jordan has a hold of Cesaro. Puts Cesaro in the corner. There's a tag to Chad Gable. Irish whip. Drop Toho. Elbow right to the back. What a kind of a Cesaro. That's Cesaro with a power slam of Chad Gable. That's Cesaro gonna taunt. There's a counter by Chad Gable. Chad Gable with a strike. Now Gable, German suplex. Folks, that could be it. That's two. Oh, but Cesaro gets his shoulder up at two. A near fall right there. I thought Chad Gable had it. What a stump there by Gable. Oh, what a kick by Cesaro. Now Cesaro with a drop kick. There's a tag to Jason Jordan. Oh, what a punch by Cesaro. Now Cesaro with the very European uppercut. Into the cover. That's two. Oh, but Jason Jordan kicks out of two. A near fall for the bar right there. Oh, what a punch by Cesaro. Now Cesaro. He has Jason Jordan. And the sharpshooter. Is Jason Jordan going to tap out to the sharpshooter? Hit it on a smackdown. Is Jason Jordan going to submit? Hit it on to Cesaro. Cesaro has that sharpshooter locked in good. Wait a minute. Jason Jordan breaks the hole. Oh, and an elbow. Back Cesaro into the corner. That's a counter by Cesaro. Irish whipped by Cesaro. There's a tag to Sheamus. Oh man, Jordan's about to go a swinging. Cesaro with his Cesaro swinging. Sheamus with a drop kick. That's it a cover. Is this going to be enough to pin Jason Jordan? No. Chad Gable breaks up the pin. Now Seamus picks up Gable. Oh, come on now, Seamus. There's the Irish Curse backbreaker. Another Irish Curse backbreaker. And Seamus with a third Irish Curse backbreaker. And Seamus taking care of Chad Gable. Oh, but Jason Jordan gonna fight back. Jason Jordan doesn't like suplex. A second one. Is it over? That's two. Oh, but look like Sheamus kicked out, but Cesaro also broke up the pin. Oh, punches by Sheamus. Oh, man, counter by Jordan. And Jordan, oh, man, went for a big boot, but it didn't connect there. That's a strike. Now Seamus has a hold of Jordan, puts Jordan in the corner. There's a counter. There's an Irish whip. There's a tag to Chad Gable. Oh man, grand amplitude. Good night, Seamus. That's two, three, no, Seamus. Just barely kicked out. Chad Gable can't believe it. Gable is stunned. This arena is stunned. Oh, and Sheamus with a bro kick. Down goes Jason Jordan. Sheamus with a bro kick. There's a tag to Cesaro. Now, both Cesaro just in the ring at this point just to pick the bones. And now Cesaro with the Gotch Neutralizer. Answer the cover. Folks, that's all she wrote. Count to 100, ref. This one's over. The bar get the victory. So, folks, the stage is set next week. The bar versus the Hardy Boys. Number one contenders match. Winner. Faces the Usos.
That backlash with a smackdown tags and titles and folks, this is 100% unnecessary. This is uncalled for Cesaro and Sheamus. Cesaro and Sheamus sending a statement to the Hardy Boys. Well, folks, what a matchup that is going to be next week on SmackDown between the Hardy Boys and the Bar. Ladies and gentlemen, up next, Mandy Rose goes one on one with Billy K. And ladies and gentlemen, at Backlash in two weeks, the Iconics would defend their women's tag team titles against Fire and Desire. What a match that is going to be at the Backlash pay per view in two weeks. But well, folks, here come Mandy Rose. And Sonya Deville, Fire and Desire. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, accompanied by Sonya Deville from Yorktown Heights, New York, Mandy Rose. The Iconics got an opportunity at the Women's Tag Team Titles. Because last week on SmackDown, Sonya Deville pinned Peyton Royce. So that is how Fire and Desire got the opportunity at those titles. But will they be able to take advantage of that opportunity come Backlash? Mandy Rose and Sonya Deville already own a pay-per-view win over the Iconics back at Roadblock. So will they be able to defeat the Iconics again? But Mandy Rose is set for action against Billy Kay tonight. And here come the current women's tag team champions. Billy Kay and Peyton Royce, the Iconics. And accompanied by Peyton Royce, representing the Iconics from Sydney, Australia. One half of the women's tag team champions. Billy Kay and Peyton Royce are the inaugural women's tag team champions. But their reign might be short lived if they are unable to defeat Fire and Desire at Backlash. It was Peyton Royce who pinned Sonya Deville back at WrestleMania. To become the inaugural women's tag team champions. These two teams have a lot of history. The Iconics and Fire and Desire. Mandy Rose. Billy Kay. The referee rings the bell and here we go. Oh what an elbow by Billy Kay. There's a counter by Mandy Rose. Counter by Billy. Now Billy Kay with a backbreaker to Mandy Rose. There's a wicked kick to the back. There's an Irish whip. Now Billy Kay. I mean, this is impressive. Head scissors takedown. Now Mandy Rose using the ropes to pull herself up. Oh man. Now Billy Kay using those long legs to her advantage. And Billy with a knee. Now folks, so far Billy Kay has been amazing in this matchup. Now Billy Kay picking up Manny Rose over Manny Rose with a counter. Oh, what a form by Manny Rose. Oh man, Manny Rose has Billy Kay. This ain't good. Oh man, face first goes Billy Kay. Into the cover. Oh, Billy Kay might be out. That's two. Oh, Billy Kay gets that shoulder up at the counter, too. Oh, what a counter by Billy Kay. Oh, man, one for a jockey that was countered by Manny Rose. And Manny Rose with a disrespectful slap across the face. There's a kick to the back. Manny Rose going to that middle rope. 
Oh man, what a counter by Billy Kay. And Billy Kay taking down Mandy Rose. Oh, what a counter by Mandy Rose. And Mandy Rose picking up Billy Kay. Oh, what a flapjack by Mandy Rose. Now Mandy Rose going to the top rope. Oh, but Billy Kay throws Mandy Rose from the top rope down to the mat. That's a stump by Billy Kay. I mean, not Billy Kay, just slamming that head of Mandy Rose down to the mat. Oh, man, Billy Kay. Brain Buster! What a brain buster to Mandy Rose. Is that going to be enough? That's two. Oh, and Mandy Rose able to get that shoulder up. Oh, what an elbow. There's an arm drag. There's a body slam. There's an Irish whip. Oh, what a form into that corner. Now, man, Rose has that arm of Billy Kay. Oh, but look at Billy Kay fighting here. Oh man, Billy came over that big boot, but that was counter. Oh man, what a bulldog. But look at Peyton Royce getting on the apron here. Oh man, and Billy Kay gonna take advantage. Oh my lord. Down goes Mandy Rose into the cover. Is this gonna be enough? No, a near fall for Billy Kay. Oh, what a kick there by Mandy Rose. Oh, man, Mandy Rose went for another kick. That was counter. Oh, my Lord. That brain buster was a wicked one. Into the cover. That's two. Oh, but Mandy Rose somehow kicks out of that wicked brain buster. Oh, what a drop toe by Mandy Rose. Mandy Rose with a kick. Mandy Rose. She has Billy Kay in a power bomb position. There's a wicked power bomb. Now look at Mandy going to the top rope. Mandy Rose pressing the top rope, perhaps waiting for Billy Kay to make it back to her feet. Billy Kay getting up. And down goes Billy Kay. And now look at the strength of Mandy Rose. Face Buster, oh man, Billy Kay's neck came in contact with those ropes. Billy Kay could very well be out of it. That's two. Oh, but a kick out somehow by Billy Kay. I'm glad Billy Kay is okay. Because that was a nasty fall. Oh, what a strike by Billy Kay. Now Billy Kay with that split. Shoulder down here. That's two. Mandy Rose able to get the shoulder up at two. Now Billy Kay going to the top rope. Billy Kay with a leg drop. And Billy Kay gonna thump. Drop to hold by Mandy Rose. Oh, what an elbow. There's a counter. There's a kick by Mandy. Wait a minute. Mandy Rose with the bed of roses. Into the cover. That's two. And that's three. Mandy Rose gets the victory. Mandy Rose. Yes, a big victory over one half of the women's tag team champions tonight. And folks, you gotta think. Does Fire and Desire have the Iconics number? Last week, Peyton Royce lost to Sonya Deville. 
This week, Billy Kay loses to Mandy Rose. This is huge momentum for Fire and Desire going into the Tag Team Championship match at Backlash in two weeks. Here is your winner, Mandy Rose. Congratulations to the Golden Goddess, Mandy Rose, on getting the victory. Hitting out on SmackDown. There's the Yes Man, Daniel Bryan. Let's see what the leader of the Yes Movement has to say. Ladies and gentlemen, it feels good to be back here tonight on SmackDown. I missed last week's show, but I am here tonight. At WrestleMania 10 nights ago, I defeated Kane, but I could not have defeated Kane without all of you all's support. So for that, I thank you all. I thank you, WWE Universe. Now I know you all have been supporting me for years now. Without you all, I would not have won the WWE World Heavyweight Championship at WrestleMania 30. But since you guys support me so much, I have to do something for you all. So I am out here right now to make a vow to you all, I am out here tonight to make a vow to the WWE Universe. I vow to become the WWE Champion before this year is out. I will work my butt off in this ring. I will spend hours in the gym. And trust me, I will become the WWE Champion before this year is out. Whether I have to face Shinsuke Nakamura, Roman Reigns, Now wait a minute, I I know that's not. It it can't be. I thought it was fired. There's Brock Lesnar and his advocate Paul Heyman. What are they doing? Hit or not on SmackDown, Brock Lesnar was just fired at WrestleMania. He lost the match to the Rock. So my question is, what is he doing? Get out on SmackDown. This is very unexpected. But Paul Heyman has a mic. Let's see what Heyman has to say. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Heyman. And I am the advocate for the Beast Incarnate. The conqueror of the streak. The man who victimized the Rocket WrestleMania. And the newest member of the SmackDown roster. Brock Lesnar. Paul. Let me stop you right there. You said he is the newest member of the SmackDown roster. But wasn't he just fired from WWE 10 nights ago? At WrestleMania when he lost to The Rock. I'm glad you brought that up Mr. Bryan. When my beast lost that match at WrestleMania against The Rock. His Rock contract was terminated. So now he is signed to a SmackDown contract. So that is why he is the newest member of the SmackDown roster. Since he is the newest member of the SmackDown roster, and since the both of you chose to come out here and interrupt me, now how about your beast fight me tonight in a match? Hit on SmackDown. Well, Mr. Bryan, my beast is not going to fight when you want him to fight. My beast is going to fight when he wants to fight he fights on his time not yours not on these fans time but on his time it sounds like he's a coward to me Paul you need to stop talking to him let him start talking for himself that's why I don't care if you're walking up to me you're not gonna do anything you're not the big bad wolf that people think you are Brock
With that being said, my beast is not going to fight tonight. But he will fight at Backlash if you're not scared to get torn to pieces. Oh, and I think Daniel Bryan has heard enough of Heyman. Oh, but wait a minute. Brock Lesnar going to protect his advocate. Oh, man. I don't know how smart that was, Brian. To just attack Lesnar. So, folks, apparently Brock Lesnar is now on SmackDown. There's a kick by Lesnar. And there's a follow his slam. And, folks, this is the first time ever since I've been doing Universe Mode that Brock Lesnar will be on the SmackDown brand as he just slams Daniel Bryan. Oh, my goodness. There's a backbreaker by Lesnar. Another backbreaker. And, folks, Daniel Bryan is in trouble. Oh, my goodness. Lesnar with a gut wrench suplex. And there's a close on to Bryan. My goodness. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back live here tonight on SmackDown. And folks, the match between Daniel Bryan and Brock Lesnar has been made official for the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks. In two weeks, will Daniel Bryan be able to perform another miracle? Will he be able to do the impossible again? He has made a career out of doing the impossible and performing miracles. Will he perform another miracle at Backlash? Turn in the Backlash in two weeks to find out. But folks, it is time for our next matchup of the evening. As here comes the awesome one. Former Intercontinental Champion. The A-lister. The Miz. And there he is. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. Well, folks, tonight we have a WrestleMania 27 rematch as The Miz prepares to do battle against John Cena tonight. These two know each other very, very well. The Miz actually defeated John Cena at WrestleMania 27, believe it or not, to retain the WWE Championship. But will The Miz be able to defeat John Cena again here tonight? And there's John Cena, the franchise player. John Cena has a tough task ahead of him in two weeks at the Backlash pay-per-view. In two weeks at Backlash, John Cena goes one-on-one -on -one with the almighty Bobby Lashley. Folks, what a matchup that is going to be. Bobby Lashley came out last week and said he's getting sick and tired of John Cena taking the spotlight. Bobby Lashley said he sat back too long. When him and Cena are on Raw. And now some down SmackDown. Lastly, it's time for him to step up. Fans behind John Cena here tonight. Referee rings the bell and here we go. Cena and Miz locking up. Cena with a headlock. Off the ropes here. And the Miz with a back body drop to Cena. There's a kick to the back. Cena getting back up. Cena with a kick. 
And now Santa, fisherman suplex. Elbow right to the chest by Cena. Cena went for a kick to the back. Miz got out of the way. Now look at Miz rolling up Cena here. Shoulders down. Miz may have him. Oh, but Cena got the shoulder up here too. Oh, what a start by Cena. Counter by Miz. Miz went for a big boot that was countered. Now Cena. Half Nelson neck breaker. Into the cover. That's two. Oh, but Miz gets that shoulder right to counter two. Another start by Cena. Went for a kick that was countered by Miz. And now Miz with a running knee. Into the cover. Is that going to be enough to beat Cena here tonight? No, Cena. Gets the shoulder up at two. That's a counter by Cena. Irish whip. Oh, what an elbow by Miz. Now look at Miz with the famous it kicks. Oh, what a kick right to the side of the head. Now Miz gonna taunt, but Cena back up. Oh man, and Cena just knocks the crap out of the Miz. Now look at Cena, look at the strength of Cena. As he suplexes the Miz back into the ring. Oh, wait a minute, look at Miz playing a possum here. That's two. Oh, but Cena gets a shoulder up at the counter, too. Oh, well, start by Cena. And Cena with a shoulder tackle. Oh, man, look at this. STF by Cena. Is Miz gonna tap out? Johnson has the STF locked in good. I'm oh, looking at Miz with some elbows to Cena, and Miz escapes it. Oh, what a driver planting Cena. Shot right to the back. Oh, what a strike by Cena. Now, Cena, AA. Oh, wait a minute, Miz. What a counter. Now look at Miz. Oh man. The figure four. Shades to the nature boy Ric Flair. Is Cena going to tap out to this figure four? Oh wait a minute. Look at Cena. Reversing the pressure. Oh, what a strike by Miz. Strike by Cena. He's still going back and forth. Miz with a kick. Oh, man, now look at the Miz. What is DDT to Cena? Into the cover. That's two. Oh, but Cena gets a shoulder up at two. One for a strike that was countered. There's another strike by Cena. And now John Cena. Springboard stunner to the Miz. Into the cover here. That's two. Oh, but Miz kicks out of two. Look at disbelief on the face of John Cena. Oh, what a counter by Cena. Cena with a strike. There's a kick. Now Santa. Fisherman suplex. Wait a minute. Miz with a counter. Miz counter with a northern light suplex. Elbow right to the chest. Now the Miz going to the top rope here. Miz drops the knee on Santa. Now Miz going to taunt. Oh, what a counter by Cena. Now Cena. AA to the Miz. One, two, three. No. Miz got the shoulder up at two. And Cena can't believe it. Oh, what a drop toe hold by the Miz. Now there's a strike by Miz. 
Wait a minute, miss. Skull Crusher finale. The Skull Crusher finale to Sam. One, two, three. No, Cena. Just barely got the shoulder up. My goodness, folks, what a match it on SmackDown. I went for a boot that was counter. Now, Cena, oh, what a face buster. Miz like we busted open. That's two. Oh, but Miz just barely kicked out of that face buster. Now look at Cena getting fired up here on the blue brand. Miz missed with that strike. And Cena with a shoulder tackle. Another shoulder tackle. And Cena slams the Miz. Now look at this. You can't see me, Miz. Hey, Miz, get a taste of this five knuckle shuffle. And I've seen him. He's really fired up tonight. What a strike there by Cena. And for a kick, that was counter. Miz spins Cena around. Oh, man. Hope this could be it. Miz. The figure four. The figure four leg lock. Applied on Cena for the second time in this match. Is Cena going to submit? Is John Cena going to submit? Cena could be on the verge of tapping out. Here on SmackDown tonight. And Cena again. Reversing the pressure. Oh, but look at Cena. Hey, to the Miz. One, two, three. John Cena defeats the Miz. Hit on SmackDown. Folks, what a match between Cena and Miz here tonight. John Cena defeats the Miz. Hit tonight on SmackDown. John Cena gains momentum. Going into his match against Bobby Lashley at the Backlash pay-per-view. After John Cena's performance in this match, I think John Cena is ready for Bobby Lashley in two weeks. I think Big Match John is ready for a battle in two weeks at Backlash. Uh, wait a minute, speaking of Lashley, there's Lashley right there. Oh, come on now, Lashley. You're going to attack the man while he has his back turned. My goodness. That's a strike by Lashley. Oh, what a super kick by Lashley. Come on, Bobby. Elbow by Lashley. Now, Lashley is looking at Cena while Cena is stunned in the corner. Is Bobby Lashley going to do something? Or is he just going to stare at Cena all night? Oh, a close line to Cena. Cena back up, though. Cena with a strike. Another strike to Lashley. Oh, but now Lashley fighting back. Lashley with a strike. Oh, flat line by Lashley. Fans trying to get behind Cena. And, folks, Cena's out after that flat line. And folks, what's going to happen? When these two fight one on one in two weeks. There's our SmackDown Women's Champion Alexa Bliss. And wait a minute, there's Paige, the former SmackDown Women's Champion. I don't think these two were planning on bumping into one another. Now wait a minute, Alexa Bliss just took a shot at Paige. And there's a suplex to Paige. Paige lost the SmackDown Women's title to Alexa Bliss. At WrestleMania in a triple threat match. Alexa Bliss pinned Emma Moon. And not Paige. And folks, Paige taking it to the champion. Oh, wait a minute. There's a kick by Alexa. And Alexa with a DDT. My goodness. Paige already has a bad neck. And folks, Paige is out of it. Oh, my goodness. Now Alexa Bliss going to work on Paige. This is uncalled for Alexa. Oh my goodness. 
That is highly unnecessary. Oh man, I'm throwing Paige into those boxes. And there's another DDT by Alexa Bliss. Come on. Now Alexa's just gonna taunt. Alexa Bliss is standing there taunting Paige. No, Paige is out of it. We're back here tonight on SmackDown. Now, folks, it is official. At Backlash in two weeks, Paige is invoking her rematch clause for the SmackDown Women's Championship. So, folks, in two weeks at Backlash, Paige versus Bliss for the SmackDown Women's title. Well, folks, it is main event time here tonight on SmackDown. As here comes Limitless Keith Lee. Bask in his glory. Here tonight on SmackDown. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Wichita Falls, Texas. Weighing in at 320 pounds. Limitless Keith Lee. This is our first time seeing Keith Lee since WrestleMania. But Keith Lee is back here tonight on SmackDown. This is a big opportunity for Keith Lee because Keith Lee is going one on one with the WWE Champion Roman Reigns. This match is not going to disappoint. I promise you that. Listen to the fans. Chanting old Bask in his glory. Here comes the current WWE Champion, the Tribal Chief, the head of the table, Roman Reigns. And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the World Heavyweight Champion, Roman Roman Reigns has been the WWE Champion since the Clash of Champions pay-per-view when he cashed in his Money in the Bank contract on Seth Rollins. Roman Reigns goes one-on-one -on -one with Shinsuke Nakamura at the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks' time for the WWE Championship. It's going to be a first-time ever matchup in Universe Mode when Shinsuke and Roman fight at Backlash. Roman Reigns defeated Seth Rollins at WrestleMania in a last man standing match to retain the WWE Championship. Roman Reigns has definitely been on top of SmackDown since winning that championship. Keith Lee, Roman Reigns. Referee Reigns to build, and here we go. Roman for a strike that was countered with a kick by Keith. Now Keith Lee with a body slam to Roman. Kick to the back. Roman getting up. Now look at Roman Reigns. Oh man, what a shot right to the back of the neck. That's a stump to Keith. Oh, but Keith Lee with an elbow. And Keith Lee with a clothesline taking down Roman. Look for a kick that was countered. Now Roman Reigns. Again with a shot right to the back of the neck. Oh, what a strike by Roman. Oh, man. Look at the power of Keith Lee. Just throwing Roman Reigns. And Keith Lee with a huge forearm. 
Look for a kick that was countered by Roman. Oh my goodness, look at the power of Roman as he power bombs Keith Lee. Into the cover here. That's two. Oh, but Keith Lee able to power out at two. Oh, what a counter by Keith. Now Keith Lee with a belly to belly. Oh man, kick countered again by Roman. And Roman with a wicked shoulder tackle. Now look at Roman Reigns with these punches on Keith Lee. Now Roman going to the middle rope. And Roman drops the knee right across the face of Keith Lee. And Roman trying to pick up Keith Lee. But Keith Lee not letting him. Now Keith Lee with a body slam to Roman. Oh man, there's a kick by Keith. Now Keith Lee. Oh man, a running sit out power bomb. Is that going to be enough to beat Roman Reigns? No, Roman Reigns able to get that shoulder up at two. Oh, what a knee by Keith Lee. There's a headbutt. Oh man, look at Keith Lee here. Oh my goodness, Keith Lee. Oh man, with the pounce. Into the cover. Is that going to be enough to beat Roman Reigns? No, Roman Reigns at two. A near fall for Keith Lee. Now what a counter by Roman. Irish whip. Clothesline in the corner. Now Roman going to the corner here. He's looking for the Superman punch. And he gets the Superman punch. But wait a minute, what is this? Is Shinsuke Nakamura here? Roman Reigns distracted. Keith Lee getting back up. Roman Reigns has his back turned. That's a strike by Keith Lee. But Keith Lee, look at this. Spirit Bomb. One, two, three. No, Roman Reigns at two. A near fall for Keith Lee. And Roman Reigns with a reversal. And Roman with a jumping clothesline. Now could Roman Reigns be looking to hit the spear. And Roman Reigns cuts Keith Lee in half with a spear. One, two, three. No, Keith Lee gets a shoulder up at two. A near fall. What a kick by Keith Lee. Oh, wait a minute, Keith Lee. Big Bang Catastrophe. Into the cover. One, two, three. Oh, but how did Roman kick out of that? My goodness, finisher after finisher after finisher. Oh, that's a start by Roman. Counter by Keith. Oh, man, down goes Roman Reigns. Look at Keith Lee here. Keith Lee with a body slam to Roman. Now Keith Lee gonna taunt. All right, Keith Lee. Oh my goodness. Did he get Roman Reigns or did he miss? I'm not quite sure. I'm assuming he, I'm assuming he connected. But it is what it is here. And over the top rope goes Roman Reigns. And Roman goes into the barricade. And now Keith Lee driving Roman Reigns' spine first into the barricade. There's a counter by Roman. And Roman with a wicked Superman punch to Keith Lee. And back into the ring goes Keith Lee as Roman delivers an elbow right to the face. Uh, folks, this could be the beginning of the end. Roman Reigns. Spear! Oh, no! Keith Lee countered it. What a counter by Keith Lee. Now Keith Lee unloading with some punches to the face of Roman Reigns.
Oh, what a kick by Keith Lee. Why don't you Keith Lee again? Spirit Bomb! One, two, three. No, Roman Reigns powers out again. My goodness, folks, what a match. Here tonight on SmackDown. There's a kick by Keith. Look at Keith Lee here. Oh, man. Roman Reigns comes down face first on the top turnbuckle. Oh, what an elbow by Roman Reigns. Look at the power of Roman. Power slam to Keith Lee. And Keith Lee rolls to the outside of the ring. Uh, Roman. Oh man, the official is down. And now Roman and Keith Lee going at it on the outside of the ring here. As a strike. Now Keith picks up Roman. Oh man. Drives Roman Reigns back first into that ring post. That's a counter by Roman. And Roman seeing to Keith Lee into the ring post now. Oh man, a head first off the ring post goes Keith Lee. Every kind of five. And Roman puts Keith Lee back into the ring. Oh, what a punch right to the side of the head. What in? Oh, man, look at the power of Keith Lee again as he just throws Roman Reigns as a strike. Roman stunned against the ropes. And Keith Lee throws Roman to the outside of the ring. Keith Lee off the ropes. And Keith Lee over the top rope. Taking out Roman Reigns. Fans chanting, this is awesome, and I agree. Folks, what a match. Hit on SmackDown. What a main event we are getting here tonight. And back into the ring goes Roman Reigns. Looking for a kick. Now it's kind of. Now Roman with a wicked Superman punch. Now Roman going to the corner here. Roman Reigns. Spear to Keith Lee. A wicked spear to Keith Lee. Into the cover. One, two, three. Oh, Keith Lee just barely got the shoulder, but Roman Reigns is furious. Roman Reigns is frustrated. What does Roman Reigns have to do to put Keith Lee away? Oh, man, and Keith Lee with a clothesline. Keith Lee going to the top rope. Keith Lee. Moonsault to Roman Reigns. They don't call him limitless for nothing. Into the cover here. Is this going to be enough? No. Roman Reigns to two. Another near fall for Keith Lee. Move for a kick. That was counter. Now Roman with an STL takedown. And Keith Lee rolls to the outside of the ring. Very wise strategy. There's a strike by Roman. Oh, well, what a knee by Keith Lee. Uh, Roman went for a Superman punch. That was counter. And there's a back suplex by Keith Lee. What an elbow by Keith. Now Roman back up. And there's a clothesline by Roman. Another clothesline. And Reigns with a jumping clothesline. Another counter by Keith. Another punch by Roman. 
Another punch. Another one. Irish whipped to the corner. Close line by Roman. Now Roman Reigns puts Keith Lee against the ropes. There's an Irish whip. Now Reigns throws Keith Lee in the air. My goodness. Oh, wait a minute. Keith Lee back to his feet. Oh, my goodness. Down goes Roman. And Roman rolls to the outside of the ring. Now Keith Lee going to the top rope. Keith Lee. Cross body taking out Roman Reigns. How can a man his size even do that? Back into the ring goes Roman. That was a counter by Roman. Now Roman with an Irish whip. And Roman with a spear cutting Keith Lee in half. Is that going to be enough to beat Keith Lee? Yes, it is. Roman Reigns gets the victory. Folks, what a match. What a main event here tonight on SmackDown. Roman Reigns gains momentum going into his match against Shinsuke Nakamura at the Backlash pay-per-view in two weeks. But folks, take nothing away from Keith Lee. That guy fought. And he fought hard. But at the end of the night, Roman Reigns is the one who is standing victorious. Congrats to Roman Reigns on getting the victory over Keith Lee in the main event of SmackDown tonight. But folks, we're out of time. This is Legend of Davis number one saying goodnight from Daytona Beach, Florida. And I'll see you all for NXT tomorrow night.